All right, Electric Motor Division, General Motors Corporation, Maintenance Instruction Auxiliary Relay 6 Pole, Maintenance Instruction 5389, and Revision B. Description 1, um, description, Auxiliary Relays, Figure 1, cover the instruction, same basic construction, even the wide variety of application difference occur with a number of contact arrangements. Having trouble with the scroll. Inspection. Number of contacts and arrangement. The coils operate at 74 volts. Control circuit with the contact arrangement with the design. Shovel the variety with the control circuit with the product operation. Individual maintenance wiring diagrams. NK relay A function. Figure 1. Typical auxiliary relay maintenance. Simplicity of the construction of the minimum. Move of the part to diffuse contact with the dust free enclosure with the satisfactory surface life. Therefore, the maintenance consists of the primary with the periodic inspection qualified relay with the continued service. Inspection, remove the relay, cover the check with the contact pitting over the burning low pressure stream of the dye and compressor with the blow layer, any with the dust of the dirt accumulation, contact with the badly warm pit to remove the overhaul relay with the denial file with the dress relay contacts. Relay contacts will turn black and varnish in time with the normal operation time. This will not impair with the relay operation and give it the need for service to inspect with the electrical connection, tighten with the electrical contact and inspect with the operating cool with the fur burn with the discolorization. Check coil resistant relay, pick up the dropout, use the value of the given insert with the data, move with the mechanical will shoot the check with the proper operation and apply lubrication any type of these relays disassembly figure two with the remove of the two screw with the lock washer holding each for the cup of the contact or similarly remove the two these screw with the lock washer holding the contact is whole housing a similar to the coil frame how the you long nose pliers slowly remove the contact housing adjust the just far enough to permit removal of the coil leave of the terminal remove the contact housing assembly complete bearing carefully and to bend with the damage indicate with the tab of the contact arms carefully remove the carrier assembly which of the mind with the armature frame and assembly with two screws lock washers to remove the coil and frame assembly for remove the Two spacer pads, which are held with the relay housing, the two screws with the lock washer, and each pad with the name plate. Remove the permit with the better half of the adjusting set screws, clearing with the plate, plate base mounting plate side with the relay. Remove the two screws with the lock washer, tool with the turn with the mounting plate with this free coil with the frame assembly removal. Our figure two shows the cutaway review of the relay, starting at one common coil core, two relay coil, um, three contact carrier assembly, four contact housing. Um, Assembly 5 coil pipe bracket, assembly 6 adjusting screw, 7 the armature frame assembly. To remove the coil from the frame assembly, remove the screw from the bottom side of the coil of the frame assembly with the end position and opposite with the, with the contact carrier and with the, do not remove the screw of the carrier and with the coil co core with the permanently cemented with the coil point pole bracket assembly when the relay was manufactured. When the bottom of the screw has been removed, the frame assembly can be promoted, per, per, rotated to permit the coil to slide off the core with the armature and frame assembly coil pole bracket assembly of the coil core. And even the repair of these items should be replaced with match assembly, so they not replaced individually. Reassemble the reassemble the relay file with the reverse order disassembly, ensure all of the parts are cleaned thoroughly, replace the coil. Make certain the leads are brought up to either side of the coil to over the contact carrier with the end of the around portion of the coil insulator facing upward apply with the screw locking material with a thread screw with the shove of the into the coil core with the make certain of the core end located with the rectangular slot with the coil frame with the before tightening the screws to give the end of the coil core. With the armature of the de-energized position and the stop number of the hex number must be adjusted to provide a five fifty-eight thousand to seventy thousand inch gap between the Coil bracket, pole, pole, pole bracket assembly, the armature and frame assembly, figure three. Figure three shows the armature frame and the end um, coil with the pole bracket gap. We're replacing the coil frame and assembly locating with the real relay housing. Make sure that the locating pins for the bottom of the frame are properly seated with the hole with the base for the relay housing. Observe whether you're adjusting stop and is located with the hole in the relay housing. Do not type in the mounting screen for the relay housing coil frame and assembly even the spacer pad until the spacer pads are placed and secure. We're replacing contact housing assembly first attached coil for these coil terminals manual position carry assembly proper placement with the contact housing relay with the housing being carefully not to bend with the damage for the indicator tab of the contact room with the range of the coil will lead so that they will not interfere with the movement. The armature during normal operation relay. Check the adjusting relay contact pressure. Check the pressure recovery with the open of a normally closed contact with the gram, the gram gauge 50 to 150 range. Check with the made with the connection of the normally closed contact strip with the within a simple low voltage 6 volt of the lamp circuit. Reading should be taken with the position of the lamp to de-energize. 
Place the probe gauge over the small hole located between the east side of the contact with the contact brush is only figure 4A. Location gauge of the proper of the measurement, relay contact pressure, stationary contacts, movable contact, minimum reading 100 gram pressure and a maximum of 150 gram pressure accessible between the contact opening. DC voltage approximately 2 to 3 volts above the radius pickup voltage and of the relay coil. Check with the pressure brick and have the open all of the wire to open all of the contact close of the coil of the energy of is energized. Minimum reading 100 grams should be obtained with the test. A minimum reading 100 grams is not obtained with the contact brushes only will have to be adjusted. Using the adjusting tool figure 5 make it a gradual adjustment along with the length for the contact brush assembly. So the typical relay adjusting tool is do not make any sharp teeth the bending with the assembly such each brush is only have the two contacts. Each contact should be checked to be sure that they are on the same plane with the main contact the stationary contact same time but do not twist and re the assembly very Slightly adjusting tool to readjust the sum of the proper pressure may after making an adjustment reach over the contact pressure to make sure that the minimum and maximum pressure range of all normal op open contacts with the relay with the energized should have the minimum of the nine hundred and thirty seven ten thousand of an inch for the air gap pick up the drop out voltage pick test form a pick up of the drop out chip with connect the variable to DC voltage supply relay as shown figure six set below fifty watt potometer with the maximum resistance gradually increase the voltage coil show the fifty watt potometer DC voltage relay test under tap with the indicating lamp five to six volt six volt DC DC volt suit the max maximum operating in the stationary contacts right here. Indicating lamp with the connect with the craft with the contact with the will mark up with the pickup of the dropout point with the coming of the gun or going off slowly reduce the dot applied volts to determine the dropout point. If the pickup of the dropout point is not observed, obtained with the server the dad check with the lead arrangement, contact pressure with the carrier, travel to react, readjust if necessary. If for adjustment have the completely replace the cycle with the two screw for the lock washer cycle with the twenty five to fifty times with the two five to five and a half volts to one half amper load test lamp connect to the craft of the set with the context positive the context should be accomplished on each cycle of the relay it must be reworked. Service data contact ten amp or seventy four volt new system called data sixty eight degrees Fahrenheit working pickup voltage maximum drip up drop out arms contact terminal normal, normal open um, normally closed fifty high pot sixty um hertz call the ground one thousand volts RMS call call the ground text twenty four hundred volts RMS contacts the ground forty fourteen hundred volts RMS contact the contacts twenty four volt RMS um, contact pressure 150 to 100, 100 to 150 grams. Contact air gap 90, 137 to 10,000 inch minimum. Arm coil frame gap 58,000 to 70,000 inch. Equipment of readjusting tool, cool frame, end kit, cool contact housing, air and carrier kit, identification plate kit. Right, that was Electric Motor Division, General Motors Corporation, Maintenance Instruction, Zillary Relay, 6 pole Maintenance Instruction 5389.